New details in a Fox 5 I-Team investigation earlier this week. Douglas County probate judge Christina Peterson must explain why she ordered a woman jailed and fined $500 after the woman asked to correct a marriage certificate issued five years ago. Fox 5 I-Team reporter Randy Travis has more. PJ Skelton was born in Thailand and raised by her biological uncle. She told the Fox 5 I team she never knew her biological father and put her uncle's name as her father on a marriage certificate. In August, after Skelton says she learned her father's name, she approached the Douglas County Probate Court in case she needed to make a correction. Instead, probate judge Christina Peterson held her in contempt of court for, quote, lying under oath and providing false information to the court. The marriage license was issued years before Peterson took office. Do solemnly affirm. This is the eighth public allegation of judicial misconduct leveled against Peterson by the State Judicial Qualifications Commission, despite her being in office less than a year. That includes ignoring the sheriff's office rule not to let people into the courthouse without being screened. She did put this courthouse in a very bad place from a security standpoint. In court filings, Peterson said she did nothing wrong. But judges who refuse to acknowledge that they are subject to the law rather than above the law don't last long in judicial office. The Supreme Court rejected a petition by the JQC to have Peterson temporarily suspended until a hearing. That won't happen until next year. By paying a $500 fine, Skelton served two days of the original 20-day sentence. In Douglas County, Randy Travis, Fox 5 News.